What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, I forgot to record an intro for today's video, so I'm doing that now. Finally got the car running down on the ground and took it for a test drive. So sit back, relax, and hopefully you'll enjoy today's content. Well, miss, I guess I'll be on my way now. All right, so we're about ready for our first start after doing all this work. Got everything sorted out, got the coil bracket finished, spark plugs are in, all the other ancillary stuff over there is taken care of. Positive battery cable is nice and done, and just cranked it over, make sure we're gonna get oil pressure, and I had the coolant temperature sensor wire hooked up to the oil pressure gauge, so I had to sort that out. But that's all taken care of now, the oil pressure light works, so before I change the oil, I'm gonna go ahead and let the existing oil run, and I got some Liquid Molly engine cleaner uh, to run through the oil system. I just kinda wanna make sure that the filter that's in there right now is gonna catch all the junk that may have gotten in there when I was cleaning off the valve cover surface, but uh, other than that, we're ready for the first start, so. Yay! Idling so nice. Dang! I just checked the fuel pressure gauge and it's sitting at about 36. Previously, with a bad FPR, it was sitting at about 57, so uh, I'd say that's a pretty significant improvement. It sounds so happy. So it's three o'clock now. We'll go ahead and pour this in here. Let it run for ten minutes. Got some serious good stuff for the old girl today. This is a uh, Liquid Molly diesel oil. 1540, non synthetic. All she needs. Alright, well, that was pretty successful. Got the oil changed, it's flushed. Hopefully, everything is nice and clean. And uh, I think we're just gonna go ahead and clean up our gigantic mess everywhere. Put it down on the ground and take it for a spin. We'll see you then. Alright. So after driving it around a little bit yesterday, I think we're in a good position to take a little test drive. So let's go to Buena Vista.
So far, we're halfway through the trip. We made it to Buena Vista, went to the hot springs, just ate at this delicious restaurant. Thanks, Max. I think it's uh, Sorel Delicatessen in Buena Vista, but that was freaking phenomenal. But the car's doing great. No, uh, I didn't hear, smell, or feel anything out of the ordinary, so I think we're in good shape. So let's see if we make it back. Donut, he says. A little donut, he says. As you can tell, that was a pretty successful test drive. Uh, there's a couple things that I need to sort out this weekend, which is our last weekend before we leave. I need to adjust the rear brakes. The pedal still travels about an inch and a half, two inches before it starts engaging the discs in the front. Um, that's been needed to be addressed for a really long time, so I think I'm gonna take the drums apart and figure that out. Uh, I think I'm gonna put a smaller set of wheels on it because those Alpina reps are kind of heavy and it shimmies a little bit. I don't know if it's a balance issue or what, but I've got a set of uh, Inky Apaches that I think will be more appropriate for this trip. I think I'm going to put our ball valve back in the heater system, just so if it gets hot up in the mountains, we can shut the heater off and I'm trying to think what else. And got a little bit of a stereo problem. I think it'd be nice to not have the rear speakers cutting in and out while we're on this long drive. But uh, other than that, I think she's pretty good. Um, I'm sure I'll do some recording this weekend. And then for the big trip, next Friday, the 20th, I am going to be filming a lot. And I want the video to be of 
much higher quality than what I've been putting out in the past. So I may not make the Tuesday edit deadline. Um, and I hope everybody be okay with that because I really want to make that video a banger. So thank you for checking out today's video. Um, hope you enjoyed your time here. Feel free to like and subscribe if you feel so inclined. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. Thank you. I love you.